everybody, it's Ingrid from Twinkle and today I'm going to be talking about pictograms, what they are and how to read them. A pictogram looks something like this. It's kind of like a bar graph that uses little pictures to represent data. Each picture can represent one or more items and this information is usually shared with us in the form of a key. For instance, in this pictogram representing children's favourite colours, we can see that each picture represents two children. There are four pictures in the red column. Because each one represents two, we would multiply four by two to get eight. That means that there are eight children whose favourite colour was red. If we look at the green column, we can see two full pictures and one half of a picture. We know that each picture represents two, so we'd multiply 2.5, the number of pictures, by two to get five. That means that five children chose green. Pictograms are a great way to introduce learners to data handling as they are very visual and learners can count the number of objects. Once they get the hang of pictograms, they might even want to take a look at bar, line or pie charts. Twinkle have some great pictogram resources like this interpreting pictograms worksheet. Its purpose is to help learners understand and work with scaled pictograms and has a variety of charts plus some questions to get them thinking. Of course, there are plenty of other relevant resources on the Twinkle website, so make sure you take a look around if that's interesting to you. Thank you so much for watching and have a lovely day.